In the mid-1900s, the Turkish Navy was researching national resources to design, develop, and construct a completely indigenous corvette. As a result, Milgem project came out. The Turkish-Greek dispute in the Aegean Sea is rooted to five decades of fraught relations. The two NATO allied states are revealed over natural resources research in the Aegean Sea. Therefore, Turkey desperately need a strong army. If you are new to this channel, please don't forget to subscribe. Milgem project is a national warship program to Republic of Turkey. Managed by the Turkish Navy, the project aims developing multi-purpose corvettes and frigates that can be deployed in a range of missions. These missions include reconnaissance, surveillance, early warning, anti-submarine warfare, surface-to-surface -surface and surface-to-air warfare, and amphibious operations. The project is genuinely described as the subclasses of multipurpose warships capable of sustaining a sea war in the littoral combat environment. It features a steel hull and fragmentation resistant composite superstructures. Fore and aft masts and funnel have been constructed with a sea resistance aluminum alloys. The warship of Milgem project are designed to fully operate at sea state 5 and partially operate at sea state 6. Reduction and management of ship structures was taken as the major input during the whole design phase. Many classified precautions were taken in order to reduce hydraulic, acoustic, magnetic, IR and radar signatures. Eight of the 12 Milgem project warships were classified as ATA classes corvette. While four of them will be equipped with additional weapon systems and that will be classified as the TF-100 class frigates. The TF-100 class tin will feature slightly larger hull and will be equipped with the MK-41 VLS. It is capable of firing RIM-66 standard, RIM-162 ESSM and VL ASROP missile, along with other systems for improved multi-role combat capabilities. On the other hand, the ADA class is a class of anti-submarine corvettes. The design concept and mission profile of the ADA class corvettes bears similarities with the Freedom class littoral combat ship developed by Lockheed Martin. Freedom class littoral combat ship is the next generation of US Navy ships. The ADA class corvette is more heavily armed and equipped with more capable radars and sonar system. The Freedom class has a higher speed and variable mission modules. On 5th July 2018, Pakistani Army ISPR announced that a Turkish firm was warned by the tender to build four Milgem corvettes for the Pakistani Navy. The first Pakistani vessel named PNS Babur was launched in 15th August 2021. On the November 2021, Pakistan held keel lying ceremony for the fourth and final Milgem corvette for the Pakistani Navy. In the December 2020, the Ukrainian Navy signed a deal with Turkey's Presidency of Defense Industries for the production of ADA class corvettes on Okean shipyard at the Mykoliv, Ukraine. More than 50 local companies, including the largest Turkish defense firms such as Alsatian, Halvation, and RMK Marine, play a significant role in Milgem project, gaining invaluable experience worship design and constructions. Dear viewers, what is the impact of Milgem project on Turkish Navy? Comment down below and don't forget to like, comment, and share this video.